Hello there, you're welcome back once again to my channel. Zimi gives you an exclusive and comprehensive information on women's health, parenting, relationship, and family care. So, guys, please, if you have not subscribed, kindly do that and also do not forget to turn on your notification bell so as to get notified whenever we upload. Thank you. So, today, viewers, we shall be discussing tips on how to overcome sexual performance anxiety, SPA. It is very important for us to note that for every kind of performance anxiety, meditation is often recommended yes as a human being you are you need to sit down get a good knowledge and understanding of yourself find out what you want and how you want them to be done and then find out those things that makes you worry or invite fears in you and with our tips today we're going to handle them very well you know, sometimes when you go to the hospital to be diagnosed of SPA, you often misdiagnosed of a right eye dysfunction, a medical condition in men. And when it's time for treatment, it's more of psychotherapy than medication. Because this is not a medical something. SPA is not a medical problem. That is why it's more, treatment is more of psychotherapy than medication. So you need to slow down and take things easy. Slow down and take your time as well. When I say slow down and take your time, some couples do not engage very well in foreplay. And it's a no, no, no thing for me. Why? Because when you engage very well in foreplay, you're setting your mood right. Foreplay is a key to unlocking new levels. Foreplay is a key to unlocking firing down. So if you want to do the do very well, if you want to enjoy everything that comes with sexual activities or with sexual intercourse or with love making, if you want to enjoy it very well, first of all, spend much time in foreplay. You need to eliminate stress. Every kind of stress, you need to eliminate it. Learn how to manage them. You can manage by relaxing. You can manage by sleeping. You can as well manage by exercising. Exercises are very good for our body. Not just because it makes us keep fit. Not just because it makes us, it keeps us energetic. But it also improves our stamina in bed. So exercises are very good. Any which one you know that can suit your body. Embrace that one. Engage in it. If you have a medical condition, meet an expert. They will tell you the one that can be well, that can be okay for you, or that will be very okay for you. So you need to get intimate in other ways. Getting intimate is not just by going down or by doing the do or by making love. No, you can get intimate by taking baths together. You can get intimate by sending sensual messages. You can get intimate by giving each other sensual massages. You can get intimate by eating together, listening to romantic songs together, watching romantic movies together. You can as well get intimate by taking turns, placing each other together through masturbation. Yes, feel free. He or she is your partner. You can take turns doing those things. Practice. Prepare, prepare, prepare. Yes. When you prepare your mind that I want to achieve this thing, you automatically get to that place. You automatically achieve it. So you need to prepare, you need to practice, practice, and practice again. You don't need to be reminded that you need to make love. You do not need it. So you need to prepare yourself at all times. You need to set your mood right at all times. You need to eat right. Yes, as adults, we are not... We don't need to be eating anything we see. We need to give ourselves some level of respect when it comes to eating. Healthful eating is advised these days. You need to eat rightly. Limit your caffeine and sugar intakes. I, did, I didn't say stop taking caffeine and sugar. No, I said limit your caffeine and sugar intakes. Be open to your partner. Tell your partner those things that makes you worry. Tell your partner those things that make that makes you fear. I'm sure, and I am assuring you that if you have an understanding partner, your partner will help you overcome those things. There 
there is nothing in this world that we can never overcome when you prepare your mind towards achieving a particular something you can get it yes you can get it own your body love yourself if you're not proud of yourself nobody can be proud of you be proud of the person you are be proud of the way you are looking and then your partner will be proud of the way you're looking as well so finally we need to understand that sex or love making is not always perfect there are times when you will go out and come back not because you're not physically okay not because you're emotionally derailed no you just don't want it that day you just don't want it and sometimes no matter how you are being turned on you still may not want it or if you're doing it you're just doing it maybe to satisfy your partner alone you're not doing it as well for your own satisfaction so thank you guys for staying with us today thank you so much and please if you have not subscribed kindly do that and also do not forget to turn on your notification bell so as to get notified whenever you upload thank you